In order to convert a native advanced PDF to CRE, the quick way of doing it is as follows. Imagine we're going into the advanced area, right? And we're picking up a template. Let us grab, these ones are all standard. That's fine. Let us grab an invoice, okay? That one right there. Let's go get the data, right? So you grab this data, correct? Mm -hmm. I'm going to put it into Notepad. So we trust that this is good data. Mm -hmm. All right, let me put it someplace. Okay, now what we do is we go to Customization, CRE Profile, uh, New. Okay, and this one is the trick in looking at this is you look at the data itself, which let me see here, and you see that it's all being referenced by this thing called record. Cool. Mm -hmm. So we're going to call this CRE um, Convert NetSuite Invoice to CRE. How's that? Sure. Okay. The template engine we want to use is the one they use, FreeMarker, and our record type is transaction because that's what gets passed in. And we're going to call this thing a record. Okay. Now we got to upload the file that we just did, right? So we grab the file we just created. You can tell where I'm going with this. Mm -hmm. All right, we hit save. Okay. And we save it. We do not do anything here. That now we can go there if we want to get bring in more data. Okay. Now all we do is bring up a test profile, right? We're going to grab an invoice, Whoops. right here, right? And we hit preview. If everything goes right, it runs. And voila, you just converted it. That's all you So do. then you start crafting save searches to bring more data elements that are relevant to the transaction. That's right. Then he can start tapping out at those pieces, right? That's right.